Welcome to another tutorial by Video Excel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create voice memos in your presentation. Voice memos, voice notes, or any audio notes that you want to leave in your presentation or your slide are just like any other audio files that you can attach to your presentation. So for this demo, I'm using PowerPoint 2016 and um, you'll notice that if you go to insert, you go to the audio option, you can click on record audio. What's different about this record audio is that anything that you record will be native to this presentation. It'll be native to this file and you don't have to worry about a linkage to an external file. So if you send this presentation or you email this presentation to a friend of yours, they will receive the voice memos along with it because those voice memos have already been embedded into this slide. So for this demo, I'm going to go ahead and add a new slide. So click on new slide. And now I want to attach a voice memo to this slide. I will go to insert um, audio and I will click on record audio. And I'm just going to go ahead and click on record here. Um, so this is recording now. Test one, two, three, test one, two, three. And I'm going to stop this. Click on OK. And you'll notice that this voice icon or a speaker icon appears in your presentation. A couple of things you can do with this. You can trim this, you can adjust the audio, uh, you can adjust the delay or the fade. So the way you would do that is uh, you would click on it and then go to playback and PowerPoint will present you with a bunch of options that you can choose from. Um, when should this audio start? When should it stop? And you can also, like I said, you can trim the audio if you want to. And you can also go ahead and add bookmarks to this audio. When you run this slide in presentation mode, if you click on this icon, the audio Over will here. play um, back. So this is recording now. Test one, two, three, test one, two, three. So there you go. This is how you can attach voice memos to your presentation. And you can also have the audio looped if that's one of the things that you're looking for. When you click on the save button, it's only going to save this presentation. This audio file is not going to be exported or will not be saved as a separate file. However, if you want to export the audio, you can right click and then click on save media as and you can choose a destination if you want to export this voice memo that you've created. Well, if you like this video, please subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks in PowerPoint and Excel. Thanks for watching.